I'm no fucking goddamn Grizzly Adams. This might come as a big surprise, but I've been in nature. When I used to work at a summer camp, we went out for this like week long hike. And like three days in, I realized I hadn't looked at myself for three days. Like three days of not seeing myself, three days of no self to, to observe. And man, I was getting so happy and like, you know, like the weightiness of the self. And then when you're with a group of people who are all working together, then your self gets transposed into the group. So now there's a group self where everyone's kind of working together. The point is, we're all, we've got our noses shoved like fucking dogs right in our own assholes, right into the asshole of ourselves, constantly thinking about ourselves, concerned about this me. Does he like me? He doesn't like me. God, that guy's doing so good. Why am I not doing as good as that guy? Holy shit, I'm getting fat. Look at your body. My God, God, you're getting old. Oh God, yourself, yourself, yourself. Everyone's fixated on it. But if you imagine that being like a kind of gravity and that somehow vanishing so you're just like a plant blowing in the wind a tree you become invisible you become invisible and you become perfect instantaneously it's this obsession with this ridiculous contrivance that we call the self that is making so many people fucking hurt and so, and all, and like talk about this new modern life. Well, it's all built on teaching people to be fixated on that fucking self.